Left-wing anti-gunners will tell you I'm crazy for continuing to push the idea that teachers need to be armed. The reality is, they do. It will save lives to push back against my idea of letting teachers volunteer to be a sheepdog, a protector of the flock. These reporters push a lie. The teachers don't want to be armed. Some don't, that's true. Many do. Look at Cincinnati. The sheriff in that county offered training to teachers to arm themselves. He had 50 spots. Hundreds of teachers applied. The mainstream media doesn't tell you that story. A former sheriff from Arizona is an economics teacher now. He wants to be armed. His name is Richard Mack. I actually interviewed the man at CPAC. Why? Because his story, his desire to protect his kids, is a story the mainstream media also refuses to tell. Instead, they want you to believe that teachers somehow don't want the responsibility. It's true that some don't, but some do. And they should be allowed to carry. Listen to this ridiculous debate with Don Lemon on CNN last night. And I don't think teachers need to add that to the things that they're already doing. I, I, the cost of a gun I think to it's all the pencils and the paper and all the things I, that they're not even paid for. So or why do we want to say no to people that are saying, I want to volunteer? If they want to choose themselves, there's because 90 teachers. Because it's not their role. And it's five not or their six role. of them want it to be hard. their role. So then we're going so to test because them. The teachers have enough to do. They have more than enough to do. Teachers. You went to school, right? Yes. Do you want your teachers? I wouldn't want any. Absolutely. I wouldn't want. Let me just say this. I wouldn't want not one. One single teacher I had in school. <laughs> not the ones who like me. Not because, the ones who because I don't you want, think they didn't look out for you. When I speak to law enforcement people, when I speak to actual teachers who I people I know are teachers, they don't know are they going to carry it on their person? Can a student brush up? They're and they're they're breaking Do up. Do they a lock fight between it? Someone right. Someone Pause grab it. The very teachers that Don Lemon are talking about are the very teachers we don't want carrying. If you don't know where to carry your firearm, if you don't know how to carry your firearm, those are not the teachers we want volunteering to carry. They talk about it's not the role of the teacher. Is it the role of an airline pilot to act as security on the plane? No. Does an airline pilot now carry? Just about every captain of an airplane that I talk to, commercial airliners, now carry a firearm. Why? Because it's about safety and security of the people on board that plane. It now is their role because terrorists made it their role, whether they like it or not. Just as for teachers, it's their role to protect their kids whether they like it or not because deranged lunatic shooters made it their role. We live in the real world. Saying teachers have enough to do. Pilots have enough to do in the cockpit as well. But we want our kids safe. And we certainly don't. And I'm with Don Lemon on this. We don't want teachers that have no idea how to use or carry firearms carrying. What I want is the teacher like myself like the teacher like Richard Mack in Arizona, who was a sheriff and is now an economics teacher inside a local high school. Those are the types of teachers we want carrying. Continue this debate. Abs a gun, where do they keep the ammunition? Uh, if they Again, lock how, it, how much are they going to be? And the kid comes in from another direction. Let me finish my thought, Ben. Okay. So for the vast majority of teachers, and for people with sense in this country, they realize... Do I not have sense? That, not because on this issue. You're a not, former you're being military or former law enforcement teacher. My thought. Can I finish my thought? Sure, but okay. to say we don't have sense, I, I think it also just shows how arrogant people no, are. No, it's not arrogant. It's like you don't... It's common sense. You can... I don't mean to offend you, but for people who have sense, they realize... I have sense. Okay. Too many, there are too many things that can happen that will go the other way. It is not worth the risk of someone who is a teacher and carrying too many people can get hurt. I'm going to tell you right now, I have common sense. The five million members of the NRA have common sense. The man that is clear that has no common sense is Don Lemon. He literally lives in Disney World. I would love for every kid to feel safe. In fact, it's my ultimate goal. I would love for every kid and teacher not have to worry about a deranged lunatic coming into their school. It's my ultimate goal. But I also realize that we live in a world where you cannot regulate evil. You cannot just wish it away by hoping and praying they don't show up. They will not show up when they know that there may be a fight on their hands when they get there. They will not show up when they know that people in that school are armed. Don Lemon, that's common sense. You don't have it. Don't ever tell anyone they don't have common sense when they don't agree with you because anyone that doesn't agree with you, to me, are the very people in this country that have the most common sense.